Good morning, YouTube. We are out here at a customer of mine fixing a bull gear of a crane. It is a little bit loud out here, so let's try to make this work without too many voiceovers. why you never leave your welding cables coiled all the way up. The electromagnetic field will move the cables and you will lose power. You have to put more power in than what you take out. It's better to always unroll them all the way and string them out. Digital readouts on this wire feeder suitcase show almost 24 volts actual welding voltage and a wire feed speed of almost 300 inches per minute. We're using 045 gas shielded flux cord wire with 7525 gas. The power source shows almost 29 volts that it delivers to put out 24 volts at the feeder. So this is a 5 volt loss due to the coiled long wires. Normally about 170 amps should not be challenging for one odd wires 
but due to the length and the coils it really affects the voltage. So YouTube, this is day two of the crane repair out here and now we're doing the back side of the ball gear. The first day everything was so loud outside so now I'm sitting in the truck cab you can actually hear me. So let's go out there and have some fun. So YouTube, today we brought a set of shorter cables to get rid of some line loss. And we have them straightened out all the way. 